Today I wanted to create a capsule wardrobe that will make it really easy to get dressed in the mornings when I'm working from home. If you're anything like me and you've been finding it hard to motivate yourself, I find that getting dressed in the morning and making a bit of a morning routine really sets me up for the day and puts me in a more productive mood. In this video, I'm going to be picking out 10 to 15 pieces of clothing that I'm going to take out of my wardrobe and put on my rack. The idea is if I have these 10 or 15 pieces out, it will make getting ready so much easier and hopefully it will get me out of my sweatpants a little bit more. These won't necessarily be the only pieces that I reach for in this period, but it's just nice and easy to have a couple of options ready for you in the morning. I decided to pick out three dresses for this capsule. The first one is a linen dress by Daily Sleeper. Daily Sleeper makes really comfortable sleepwear inspired clothing. This dress will be perfect for lounging around on the weekend or in evenings, but it will also look really chic and put together for a Zoom meeting or for working from home. My second dress pick is the Vivette Nightgown by Do Wen. Even though this is a nightgown, I tend to wear it more as a casual day dress. It is a light cotton material and it makes me feel super pretty when I have it on and it's a really lovely piece for the weekend. Well, I think I'll start a war with all the things I've My last dress pick is by Christy Dawn and it's their classic dawn dress. Because my other two dresses were both block colours, I decided to go for a printed one, and this one is very voluminous and easy to wear. If you can't tell, there is definitely a pattern of preferring longer, midi or maxi dresses. I just find them a little bit more comfortable for lounging around in, and also it's starting to get a little bit cooler here in Sydney, and these dresses are perfect if I wanted to layer on a cardigan or knit over the top. I decided to pick out four tops for this capsule which would cover me for a range of occasions. The first piece I picked out is an 100% linen piece from Everlane. I really love the neckline on this which gives it a slightly more feminine and dressy look. I find this to be the perfect piece if I had video calls and wanted to look a bit nicer while working from home. I felt like my capsule had to have at least one short sleeve t-shirt. I decided to go for this one from Balzac because it really is the best of both worlds. It's a t-shirt so really easy and comfortable to wear, but it also is a silver material with ruffles on the sleeve that just gives it a more put together look. A Breton top is such a classic for any capsule. Because the weather is starting to cool here in Sydney, this long sleeve top is just a very practical pick. It's definitely hard to go wrong with a Breton top as you can style it with just about everything and it's also one of those chic effortless pieces that's always in style. I decided to pick one blouse for this capsule and I went for one by Do Wen. This is in the prettiest fabric and I love all the details on it. It makes me feel super happy and it's this really lovely cotton viscose material that feels very light on the skin. Given that it's very voluminous, it feels just like loungewear, but it has a much more cute and feminine look. I picked out three knitwear options to choose from. My first one is the Cezanne Leontine jumper. There is something about this that looks just so effortless but polished. This has just been one of those really easy pieces to throw on top of my clothes if I'm hopping on to a call or if I want to look a little bit more put together. With their heads stuck in the ground and they don't The next piece is a white cardigan from Everlane. I've been eyeing up the beautiful cardigans by a Spanish brand called Barba, which I'm sure I'm mispronouncing, but this Everlane one gives a very similar aesthetic. It has a really beautiful texture with it being so chunky, and this has been permanently at my desk for those cooler evenings to throw on. The last knit is my Everlane cashmere jumper and this is so beautiful and luxurious. 
I definitely haven't let the fact that I'm working from home stop me from wearing this piece. I really love it, it's so soft on the skin and it is by far my most comfortable and luxurious jumper. Because it feels very nice and quality, I'm actually just not worried about it at all when I'm wearing it at home. It definitely feels like it's made to last and honestly, I do not baby this piece at all. I picked three bottoms for this capsule and I'm definitely guilty of wearing a nicer top and PJ bottoms when I'm working from home. If I wanted to put together a full outfit, here are my three picks for bottoms. I decided I needed to have at least one skirt in this capsule for those warmer days. This Cezanne skirt has the prettiest pattern that instantly just brightens my day. It is also super light on the skin being silk and it's just very easy to style. Let's be real, sweatpants were definitely going to be a part of this capsule. This pair is from Cotton On and I feel like I've had it for about 6 to 8 years by now. It has been in my wardrobe for so many years and I love it. It's comfortable, it's easy and there's really not much more to say. It's a pair of sweatpants. My last pick are these white Uniqlo jeans and guys, these are not regular jeans. Not only do these have a ton of stretch to them, they're also wide-legged. So these definitely don't feel like restrictive jeans, they're super easy to wear and I can sit around in them all day without feeling any kind of discomfort. Actually, as we speak, I currently have these on and I can vouch for them being just amazing to work in all day. That's all for this little capsule wardrobe, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want to see some of these pieces in action and see some of the outfits that I've created with these pieces, head over to my Instagram where I have quite a few looks on an IGTV. If you guys enjoyed this video, please hit the like button below and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!